Hello and welcome to another reading from the book That I May Know Him, a daily devotional. Today's reading is entitled Fullness of the Godhead, November 30th. And every creature which is in heaven and on the earth and under the earth and such as are in the sea and all that are in them heard I saying, Blessing and honour and glory and power be unto him that sitteth upon the throne and unto the Lamb for ever and ever. Revelation 5.13 On the Isle of Patmos, John saw the things which God desired him to give to the people. Here is a theme worthy of our contemplation. Here are large and comprehensive lessons which all the angelic hosts are now seeking to communicate. Infinite wisdom, infinite love, infinite justice, infinite mercy, depths, heights, lengths, and breadths. Numberless pens have been employed to represent the life and character and mediatorial work of Christ, and yet to every mind through whom the Holy Spirit works, these themes are presented fresh and new, just in accordance with the mind and spirit of the human agent. The Lord Jesus promised that the Spirit he would send would recall his words to the minds of those prepared to receive them. After his resurrection, he opened their understanding that they might understand the scriptures. Up to that time, the disciples had not comprehended them, for the rubbish of rabbinical lore had hidden the truth from their view. The truth, if received, is capable of constant expansion and new developments. It will increase in brightness as we behold it and grow in height and depth as we aspire to grasp it. Thus it will elevate us to the standard of perfection and give us faith and trust in God as our strength for the work before us. We need the truth as it is in Jesus. As his representatives and witnesses, we need to come to a full understanding of the saving truth which we must know by experimental knowledge. In whom we have redemption through his blood, even the forgiveness of sins. Colossians 1.14 This is the great practical truth which must be stamped upon the soul. It is of the greatest importance that all should comprehend the greatness and power of the truth to those who receive it. In him dwelleth all the fullness of the Godhead bodily. Colossians 2 verse 9 Thank you for listening today. Be sure to join me tomorrow for another reading from the book that I may know him. Be encouraged.